So these are uh, members of our team, the Bold Hearts from the University of Hertfordshire. And it's a RoboCup football team, so it's a world championship of robots, robotic football. And it's a worldwide competition with universities from all over the world participating. And usually we have a few more on the field, so they play four against four. And they basically try to learn to play football. Uh, with the final goal to play in 10, 2050 against uh, human world champions and beat them at the, the game of football. The big challenge is, is the dynamics of everything. Um, stuff is moving around, have to adapt to that, have to uh, be able to deal with any type of, of, of situation. And our robots actually do that by, by being quite stupid. So they, they don't try to think too hard. They just try to be able in any situation to figure out where the ball is, where the goal is, and then, then play the game. It has a couple of sensors, it has a little camera in his head uh, that that's, that's, does some video processing to figure out where all the ob objects are in the world. Um, but then for the walking, it has a couple of sensors, it has a gyroscope, accelerometer in his body. And he uses that to, to figure out how his balance is and uh, basically tries to detect changes from no normal patterns and then tries to adapt this, his ankle joints and other joints a little bit to, to try to stay upright. And, but sometimes it falls over, actually, quite often it falls over uh, and, and still has to come up on its own. They have to play fully autonomously, so we, we try to train them to be able to do everything uh, without any, any human help. Stability is a really big issue. Uh, for us, if we walk around, we don't even think about it, but all our muscles are at work. There's a big part of our brain subconsciously working or not trying to fall over. Uh, if we hit something, then we can, can recuperate from that. And for robots, it's really difficult because they firstly have a really limited body, uh, really limited dynamics. Uh, and the whole intelligence of, of, of uh, working in a dynamic environment is, is still, still not there. So that, that's really a really big challenge. So two years ago, we came second in the world. That was a world championship in Brazil. And two weeks ago, we just came from a competition in Iran. Uh, we're also some, some good teams there and, and we actually won it. So we're, we're, we're doing quite well, but there's still a lot of challenges for, for the next World Championship. So still a lot of, lot of work to do.